Hi guys, today we are going to talk about organization structure and relate to the case of Semco. My name is Wei Duo Cai. My group member is Hui Qing Yang. Firstly, let me introduce the company management development. In 1953, Antonio created Semco, which focused on marine pump business. It has a strictly hierarchy-based company. Negative relationship with staff and related employee. In 1982, the company has financial problems and dismissed around 66% of the company's executive when Antonio's son, Ricardo, take over Semco. He pushed further to democratize and let staff enjoy working life. Nowadays, Semco is one of the few truly democratic workplaces. Its revenue margins, employee stress, and business segments expanded significantly. And then let's relate about condition into management style. When Ricardo took over the business, its management style is machinistic form. Every business division had the rights to allocate the finance self run team and decide the strategy by themselves. Corporate justify division's performance by SS division's performance one half yearly basis. In contrast, when SAMCO is created at the beginning, corporate level rela uh, regulate and policies govern every issue regulates employees' working life and stress control from top to down. And next, we relate about condition to organization structure. In 1953, its weakness were hierarchy overload, less innovation and restricted view of organizational goals. However, this organization structure also promotes co corporate enabling deep knowledge do the best in only one or a few products and short-term efficiency. After Ricardo taking over the company, its organization structure changed from functional structure to matrix structure because he involves high coordination to meet due demand and flexible sharing. But this kind of structure costs due authority and consume lots of time. High brand structure is more suitable for current unstable economic environment because the employee is assessed right task according to right professional. As a advantage directly fulfill above two structures weakness because it increase efficiency, develop skill and flexibility. Hello everyone, my name is Vanessa, my group member is Wei Dong. So next we'll talk about the uh, semico. So this So this page is talk about the HR policy uh, in Semico. So first one, the human resource policy implemented by Semico is the key to the successful turnaround of the company. So its HR staff is well uh, aware that the traditional par uh, the traditional participatories. The management is the hollow words because of the four barriers, the size and the hierarchy and, uh, and the lack of the motivations of ignorance. When the people feel small in a large production, uh, production units, uh, the sense of the helplessness uh, can lead them to disregard the interest of the company. The new human resource uh, policies of the Semico pen, uh, penetrates the values of the democracy. The perfect share and the information into the value of the company. So compared with uh, the unveiling 
all based of the former uh, employees to the instructions. The new measures improve the active participation of the employees. So uh, this is a way to emphasize employees' participation and reduce the constructions of the traditional managers. So at the same time, uh, the SEMCO has uh, adopted a uh, higher and the idols approach to the com uh, compa uh, compared to hierarchy, which stem from a uh, philosophy of letter uh, employees take take charge of their own lives. So when HR abolished the company rules and the regulations, the problem was better solved. So such decisions uh, uh, emphasize personal responsibility and uh, encourage male the uh, decent decence and the better motivations uh, employ, uh, employees to be uh, critical of the judgment. So next next page is the uh, talk about the HR policies in semical the so interviews and this the one is mm, is the innovative policy reflect uh, reflection uh semical post uh, innovations uh the emphasis on the autonomy. Uh, transparency and individual jobs and personal uh, accountability and, and the third page is a uh, talk about the downsizing in Democo. so one of the one of the more shocking uh, aspect aspects of the Samco uh, lay, <clears throat> uh layoff was that sixty six percent of the company's top management were fired uh fired and this is the big operation for any company such the measures uh, are undoubtedly pioneering and the reasons behind behind them are also close the related to be implementations of the human resource after re Remove of the sixty six percent of the company's top ranks, the uh, hierarchy um, collapsed. Clippers, the autonomy was the stressed, and the results were uh, results were elective more efe uh, efficient efficiently. So the move is undoubtedly a better link between the various small departments of the. Alliance. So, the, so the last page is uh is the reference list for for this PowerPoint. So thank you for listening.